Our dream is to revitalize Hong Kong traditional wet market. The proposed location is Sain Pun Wet Market. Here are four existing problems that we observed. The first problem is about the water drainage. Even though the floor has already designed with tactile paving floor tile, which increases the friction, there is always an accumulation of water on the floor as we observed. The floor becomes slippery and accidents may easily occur. Injuries may result. Secondly, foot waste is always an urgent problem. Once the expiration date is over, the food is no longer capable to eat. This creates a lot of food waste along the corner of the market, waiting for others to collect them. This brings forward to another serious problem, poor hygiene. Food in the market is always put in a mess. We can find the fragments of food everywhere on the floor. Rotten food, especially in summer, will always create an unpleasant smell and is favorable for bacteria to reproduce in this environment. Lastly, ventilation. Though there is an air conditioning system, there is a lack of air extractors which intensify the problem of bad smell, bringing people a feeling of dizziness and stuffiness, providing an uncomfortable experience for people inside the market. Corresponding to the problem of hygiene and food waste, the first part would be a greenery's farming system. Continuous production of food waste and organic waste can be perfect raw materials to make fertilizers. It also gives a sense of biophilia. Details of the project will be discussed now. We proposed to plant vertically on the wall of the market. Besides improving the aesthetic look of the market and giving a sense of nature, it can also reduce carbon footprint by absorbing pollutants and carbon dioxide, which improve the quality of air. It produces oxygen for respiration of human. It leverages a beneficial cyclic process, which reflects the concept of being locally attuned and responsive in life's principle. Rainwater is captured on our roof for water irrigation to our plants. The roof is slightly slanted so that rainwater can fall onto the plants more efficiently. The roof is double-sided with one side in solar panels and another in hydrophobic materials. Sensors are installed to detect the weather. On sunny days, the face with solar panels face up to collect sunlight for electricity generation for the market. On rainy days, the roof turns upside down automatically and repel water down onto the plants. To avoid suffocation of plants, there is also a sensor to detect the rain level. A glass barrier will be activated to prevent too much water from dripping on the plants. It works in a way of mechanical Louvre's concept. To recycle the massive food waste produced every day, it is proposed to create a system to collect food waste from each store. There are waste installed at the back of each store that allow hawkers to pour their waste there. Weight sensors detect the food waste and the waste are sent through the pipeline system to reach the central food waste processor located at the corner of each floor which finally turn into fertilizers. Through these improvements, the market is a self-sufficient system which acts like a full biomimicry of the ecosystem. Corresponding to the problems of water drainage, hygiene and ventilation, the second part mainly focuses on the interior in design. We aimed to create a dry and clean environment that attracts customers, inspired by the design of dry markets in foreign countries. First, we think that we can use floor materials that dry up faster. By looking at the tiny nanoscale features on the surface of insects and the lotus leaf, we can apply water repellent materials on the floor tiles. Since the water droplets are too big to penetrate the surface of floor tiles and remain on the top of them, floating on the cushion of air, therefore the hydrophobic surface remains dry. Furthermore, these can automatically provide a self-cleaning function. As for the ventilation problem, it is observed that bad smelling of the seafood affects the attractiveness of the wet market. However, there is already air conditioning in the market so this limits the chance for us to add windows. To further improve this situation, it is suggested to use biofilter for odor removal. It uses moist organic materials to absorb and then biologically degrade odorous compounds.